Oh yeah, you know, it's your first game, it's your senior year, so it's you know, it's so I, I I was talking to my mother yesterday and I was like, Mom, this is your son's last first football game, last first season and everything and uh it's you know it's it's bittersweet, but uh you know, we're more than excited and uh Got a new team, same dream, but uh, we're just ready to go and uh, get after RMU on uh, Saturday night. How do you guys balance the confidence of going into a season as the national champion with also that realization that you have a huge target on your back? Yeah, you, like, uh, last year I did an interview and I remember saying we have the biggest biggest target on our back because I, we won it the year before, but now you got two years in a row and you know everyone, they, they're going to circle you on your calendar, but... You also got to realize that everyone starts off the season the same, zero and zero. So everyone's record is the same. So it doesn't matter what you did the year before because it's a, it's a brand new season and uh, everyone's uh, playing for the same goal. How oh, excited are you guys just after you know, a couple of weeks of grinding through camp and through practice to have an opportunity just to hit somebody? In the oh, yeah. Season? Yeah, you want to hit someone else. I mean, uh, hitting guys blue and white is gets so old because, like, your own teammates, you've been family for four years. So, I mean, yeah, you got to get better. You got to tackle them. But, uh It'll be nice getting out there Saturday night to hit someone else. What stands out about Robert Morris that will give you guys a challenge on Saturday? Uh, coaches talk to us. I mean, you can't look at a record from last year because, yeah, I think they under underachieved in their record stance. But if you go back and you actually study the film, you'll see that they were in almost every game to the last second. So, yeah, you can tell they're, they're buying at the bit to get their next season started because uh, they just don't want to remember last year. And I think... I mean, we're a great, we're a great first opponent because they'll tell them where they're at, and I think uh, we got to be ready. We got to be firing all pistons to be ready to play tomorrow night or they're, Saturday night. Their their offense. What kind of challenges will they provide you guys as a defense? What do they do well? They do very well at uh, just uh, bringing in tight ends. Uh, they run the ball very well, and uh, you know we got a new quarterback, so we, we don't know anything about them. So I mean, that'll be we're at the just on the fly. But uh, other than that, we'll just have to play our defense. We don't we like to just go out there with our game plan and tell them, hey, they need to beat us. Good or bad, what, what stands out to you so far that you've seen in camp from this team? Uh, I think good thing is we got a lot of guys with a lot of experience. That's that's great. It, um, it doesn't really matter how you get your experience, but uh, if you, as long as you know where you've been, it's really going to help to where the future of the football program will go. Uh, bad, I think. Um, oh man, you just. I think bad is uh, we won two national championships. Honestly, uh, guys are. You can think about it. You know, you don't really want to think about it because it doesn't matter what we did in 2016 or 17 because it has no effect on 2018 school. And I think that's bad opening up a game because you want to be able to open up and say we're zero and zero. We're not whatever we were last year. Even though you say it might be bad, is there anything that you can take from oh. last year and apply it this year? Oh yeah, I mean, uh, I mean, when you get to the playoffs like last year, you're going to play every every game is going to be a hard game fought to the end, and I think that helps us a lot because we're going to play Robert Morris and they're. You know, they're a talented group, and uh, they're just going to be like another playoff game. So we have to treat them like a playoff game and uh, give it give it our best. You've got some preseason accolades yourself here. Any a added pressure coming in for you? You know, you, it's awesome to get them, but, uh, you know, it's just a preseason thing. You know, you want to be able to take that and uh, just put it, tuck it away because, I mean, yeah, it's cool to get it, but also you just got to be able to be a leader on the team, take the team where you want it to be because uh, a leader can take a team down the, down the garbage chute, like Coach D says, or you can take it to the top. So... Obviously, you want to be the leader that takes your team as far as you can.